Oh, what do we have here? A fridge full of food? Oh, wait, is that doll food? Polymer clay is one of the best ingredients for making mini meals. Knead a clay ball into a flat bread. Twist a cone. Use a pastry bag and a nozzle. Make some multicolored balls. Now put the balls in the cone. Using an old toothbrush, give it a rough texture. Paint on some chocolate glaze with gel nail polish. Cut off the tip of a toothpick. Draw a spiral line. Decorate the ice cream with striped straws. Add some sparkles. Appetizing and totally calorie free! What an incredible treat! Okay, now get some beige clay and some gel varnish. Roll a ball and press it to the board. Use a dotter to make a hole in the center. Take a small foam brush. Paint the bagel light brown. Cover the top with brown lacquer. Decorate the glaze with white icing. You baked such cute mini donuts. Put them up in a box. Mmm, donuts! Is there anything better? These mini donuts won't make you gain any weight, even if you eat the whole package. You might get a little sick, though. Next, you'll need a transparent button and a plastic pipette. Cut off the round end. Then cut off a small ring. Cut it like this. Attach it to the round part at the side. Hot glue the cup to the bottom. Use a stick to fill it up with brown gel varnish. Bake it under a UV lamp. Use a thin brush to draw foam on the surface. Drop a white gel varnish and draw some stains with a skewer. Put it in the lamp. Mmm, smells delicious! It's time to take a break from studying and have a little coffee break. Treats are already on the table. Are you coming? Now take a piece of white clay. Shape it like a pear. Cut it in half. Put a brown heart-shaped seed in one of the halves. Put a deeper one on the other. Turn it over and squeeze out the small dimples on the peel. Paint it. Yellow pulp, green peel. What a cute little avocado. You can't even tell that it's fake. Well kid, did you recognize your big brother? For this next recipe, arm yourself with a scalpel and an eraser. Cut off a piece of the eraser. Put an elastic band on a toothpick. Cut off the extra. Paint it with brown varnish. Cut the edge at an angle. Wrap the ice cream bar in foil. Use tweezers to carefully wrap the edges. Mmm, what a sweet treat! Who wouldn't love this? Now take a plastic cap. You'll need some colorful clay. Put a clay ball in the garlic press. Squeeze out some long pasta. Collect all the spaghetti and twist it up. Put them in the cap. Cut out some meat and vegetables from the clay. Season your pasta. Put a 
couple sticks in there and pour in some clear gel varnish. Bake it all under the UV lamp. Now fasten the cap and the label. Careful, it's spicy! Bon appetit! For this meal, you'll need a plastic knife and some beige clay. Knead the clay on the board. Cut all the extra off to make a neat square. Use a toothbrush to texture the surface. Make another piece like that. Cut it in half. Twist a few strands and fasten them with a wave between slices. Paint them. Paint the bread white. The crust golden. To make it believable, use a sponge to paint it on. Paint the filling in all colors of the rainbow. A fabulous sandwich for baby unicorns is ready. A real rainbow delight. Did your pearl necklace break? Instead of getting upset, take a couple of beads. Paint them light green. Use a wide brush to paint red veins. Insert a stick into the hole. Paint them with dark red nail polish. Put the apples on a piece of parchment. Would you like to taste the forbidden fruit? It's even got a caramel glaze! Now get a plastic pipette. Cut off the round end. Cut off the middle part like this. Glue the blank to the plastic. Cut it the same size as the bottom. Flip it over and cover it with a piece of foam paper. Cut it out. This will be the cork. Now get some yellow paint and Elmer's glue. Mix them together. Use the pipette to pour the mixture into the bottle. Glue a piece of fabric to the lid. Attach it with an elastic band. Add a honey label. Winnie the Pooh would not be happy with this portion size. So I guess we just won't tell him. For this recipe, empty a tic-tac box and get a box cutter ready. Cut off the bottom of the box. Remove the lid. Cut the extra off so the lid can fit on the open bottom. Remove the label. Fill up the mini lunchbox with a few sweet treats. As you can see, a tic-tac box makes a beautiful food container. Our tiny treats will stay fresh forever in there. Okay, maybe the clay has something to do with it. Now, let's experiment with modeling clay. Roll out a big piece. Cut off the extra with a plastic knife to make a rectangle. Put a layer of black and white clay on top. Roll it up. Paint it with a sponge up to the crust. Decorate it with a delicate pink cream. Do you want a piece? My mouth is totally watering. For this recipe, you'll need another pipette. Cut off the round end. Take a toothpick. Use pliers to cut it into several parts. Put a piece of toothpick on half of a bead and the cut part of the pipette on top. Cheers? It's a little early for that. Fill the glass with transparent gel. Add just a drop of colored polish. Fill it with glitter. Mix it up with a toothpick and add some more glitter on top. Put a mini pom-pom on a piece of wire. Insert it into the glass instead of a straw. Bake it under the UV lamp. Drinks are served! Let's 
Let's toast to these crafts. This recipe calls for an empty pill blister and some clay. Press the clay tightly against the cell. Cut it out like this. Put the ingredients on the board. Roll out a small piece of white clay. Press the edges with a toothpick. Assemble the snack. Put these parts along the edges and a contrasting layer between them, and the macaroon is ready. It's a pity that it's a little trickier to make this dessert edible. Okay, now let's get a nail file and a scalpel. Cut off a few squares. Paint it to look like some toast. Make a blot with white varnish. Instead of a yolk, put half of a yellow bead. Cover the other piece with a layer of red varnish. Attach the toast with the egg to it. Your breakfast is served! What do we have here? Zero calorie gorgeous toast? Let's tuck it in! Bon appetit! But don't eat too much! <sighs> Did you like our tiny little recipes? Which made your mouth water the most? Let us know in the comments! And if you like this video, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up! If you're new here, subscribe to the channel and click on the bell so you don't miss our next delicious and nutritious video!